Question 2. Read the following statements and answer the four items that follow. Five cities P, Q, R, S and T are connected by different modes of transport as follows. We are given five statements. To analyze them easily, we break down those statements into a pictorial form. Uh, so we'll for that, we'll write P, Q, R, S, T, the cities. So it is given P and Q are connected by boat as well as rail. So here, boat as well as rail. Okay. Now S and R, S and R are connected by bus and boat. So S and R, bus boat okay now q and t are connected by air only q and t um, connected by air only okay p and r are connected by boat only so here boat only P and R are connected by boat only and T and R are connected by rail and bus, rail and bus. So we got our figure. Now we can go to the questions. Question two, which mode of transport would help one to reach R starting from Q, but without changing the mode of transport. So we have to start from Q. So if you go uh, from Q, you can go to P or T since the uh, if you go to T, then you will have to use the air method and there is no air anywhere else. So this is not the right path. So we will start from Q then to P uh, from there uh, we can reach R. So P to R only boat is available. So Q to P there is boat also. So we can choose boat. So without changing the mode of transport, we can start from Q and reach R. So boat is the, so, sorry, bo boat is the uh, correct answer.